guys, it's Sam and this is my Rainbow Thon TBR. So this is the second Rainbow Thon Readathon that's taking place. This is being hosted by Kayla of Book of Doodles, Lainey of Gingery's Lainey, Jillian of Bookish and Nerdy, and Riley of Riley Marie. I think it's just Riley Marie. But all their channel links will be listed down below. This readathon is taking place from February 7th to February 14th, and the whole point is to kind of read the rainbow. So your TBR should be a rainbow of different colored spines. So the colors they selected are red, orange, yellow, green, blue, and purple. They did not do indigo because it's basically purplish blue and all that complication. So basically you can read six books of all different of those colors. You can also combine a couple of colors if there's a couple of colors on the spine and read like four books. So you can do like if there's a orange and red spine and that counts for one and stuff like that. Or you can read all six books of the same color. So all green spines, all blue spines, whatever. For me, I'm going to be reading four books of some different colored spines and I will show you those now. First color is red and that is going to be Cruel Beauty by Rosamund Hodge. This is a Beauty and the Beast retelling and I've heard mixed things about it. Some people either love it or hate it, but I've heard it's kind of a darker story and I've heard from some people that it's kind of like if Alina from the Grisha trilogy decided to go bad and that's all I kind of need. So if we have the main character kind of going a little villainous and going on the dark side a little bit, I'm interested. So we will see how I feel about this, but it's been on my shelf for a very long time. I'm excited to finally get to it and it's a retelling. It needs to happen. The next colors are orange and yellow and for that I'm going to be reading Illumine by Jay Kristoff and Amy Kaufman. This is the first book in a science fiction trilogy and everyone's been talking about it. I really know nothing about it. I think there's like an alien invasion or a spaceship something. I don't really know, but it's told in a very unique way. There's like documents and text messages and stuff like that. And it's going to be a fairly quick read from what I hear, even though it's a chunker. I got this book actually at BEA this year and just never picked it up, even though I've been hearing really great things about it. But I think now is the time I'm in a very science fiction-y type mood and it should be pretty quick to read during readathon, even though it looks huge. The next two colors are green and blue, and I actually have two choices for this depending on my mood at the time. So the first potential one is Never Never by Brianna Shroom. This is is a Peter Pan retelling with Captain Hook. It's kind of like a Captain Hook origin story retelling type thing and I'm all about that. I'm all about pirates all of the time. The other option is These Broken Stars by Amy Kaufman and Megan Spooner. This is another science fiction book so I figure if I'm on a science fiction kick after or before Illuminae or something I might select this one instead of Never Never. We'll see but I heard this is kind of like Titanic in space a little bit. So like star cross lovers, stuff like that. I'm all about that. And the last color is purple and for that I want to read Winter Spell by Claire Legrand. This is a Nutcracker retelling. I was putting this one off until we got some snow. I'm filming this a little bit early but the big blizzard just happened out here on the east coast so there is snow outside. I'm in the mood to kind of read a wintry Christmassy tale even though it's past Christmas but in my head it's kind of still Christmas because it hasn't snowed until now. But I haven't heard a ton about this. I have heard that there are some LGBTQ plus themes in here though. So, so I'm very excited. Retelling plus LGBTQ plus themes. I'm all about that. So that is it for my Rainbowthon TBR. Comment down below and let me know what you guys plan on reading for Rainbowthon. So thank you all for watching and I'll see all of you guys soon. Bye!